Picture me, 18 years old and wanting my first tattoo. I book the appointment and on the morning of that appointment, I'm terrified. I don't know what to expect and I'm worried. As I walk into the shop, I'm greeted by a woman with blue hair called Ruth. She takes me through and sits me down in the chair and by this point I'm sweating propulsively. Ruth would go on to give me my first tattoo. This one, to be precise. She turns to me and asks me, do I want to play any music? I was too distracted to really think of anything, so I let her put on her own music. She presses play, my heart stopped. I don't know what song was going to come on. And to my relief, Public Enemy starts playing. And then from there on out, various other 80s to 90s hip hop. I'll never forget that. Flash forward four years after many more tattoo appointments and Ruth asked me if I could film her wedding. And weddings are all a little bit, we found it a bit hard to have a wedding, which isn't us. Mm. So that's why we've gone for the travel theme. Because that's kind of how I think our relationship was built. Yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm on that. So we've picked four countries um, that we're going to represent. India, South Africa, <laughs> China, China, Mexico. Well done. South Africa, she's got an old Land Rover. It's all, it's all mossy sort of mossy and, and like realistic looking animals. Giraffe. <laughs> Lion. Lion. An elephant. Zebra. Did we get a zebra in the end? Rhino? Rhino. Got loads of crap. They're all like big, giant, like photographs. So that's South Africa sorted. Then we've got um, India. We've got loads of low cushions. It is all very zen. Yeah. China. We've got loads of, um, we've basically got a scaffolding we can put up. Um, Two scaffolding rigs, which are like 17 foot, 30 foot, and 20 foot, and 17 foot high. Two like blocks of them. We've handmade a, you know, like a dragon dance costume. We've made one of them. We've made one. It's ridiculous. Labour of love, that. It was insane. Um, made the head out of cardboard which is insane it's massive so that's gonna be somewhere um, two you know the food dogs dogs that guard there's always like a male and a female oh yeah and they're like Normally guardians mm. got a couple of them just obvious you say that was it for china yeah you keep going <laughs> That's it, and I'm like, okay, and then you're That's like, for China. <laughs> On to the next. Got, we've also got, you know, like lucky cats. We got get like, that. how many of them? I don't know, a lot. A lot of them. And we're we like doing like days. a whole area just lucky cats. Brilliant. So just getting like a them. chest of drawers and just filling all the drawers, putting them all on the side, all mm. like. All doing the thing. Mexico is all like Day of the Dead style oh, cool. related skulls and stuff. <laughs> We've got a tequila like station, so an actual tequila station, and it's in like our Bible of you must do a tequila shop before you leave. Fair. <laughs> I don't know why we thought that was a good idea, but we did. And then we've obviously got a travel theme throughout, so we've got things like stacks of suitcases where people can write like postcards as a guest book and like throw a postcard to us. We've got like loads of photographs of us when we were traveling that are all gonna be like hanging up. Uh, we've got cranes. Cranes. Origami, origami cranes. Origami cranes. I've been busting out origami yeah. cranes. Serious origami <laughs> cranes. Our altar is like a bamboo structure with all like netting hanging and then like hundreds of origami cranes hanging and two cherry blossom trees either side of it. Just to throw it in, we've got a temporary tattoo station. Yeah. It's just turt weird. really. Not mm. a lot of Lot of turt. Mm. We're hoping it doesn't look like a jungle style. <laughs> but There's no not. guarantees. But it may look like a theme park is closing down. Yeah. <laughs> it might look right, it's strange. <laughs> in I can show you field. a picture if that makes it easier. Yeah. yeah. And, and I'll have a beer, right? <laughs>
at five o'clock we've got a manhunt of 18 racing pigeons. Yeah. And we're going to oh. release. <laughs> and they're all like tagged. Yeah. And we're having an official race. We've got a bookie. There's 18 like people who went on like the hen parties. So each one of us is releasing, hand releasing some pigeons. <laughs> because we're prepared to stand at the end of an aisle whilst the other one walks in. Not fair, is it? Not fair. Yeah, Both fair. bride. Both bride. What's going to work is there is going to be a weird entrance. And the main star done so well. So good. <laughs> oh my god, Ben, honestly, smashed it. So good. Smashed it up so up. much. It's everything we wanted. Right, I'm gonna cry. Oh. Keep going. Never marry, but oh, how you don't remember me. I still owe money to the money. To the money I owe, I never thought.